Hey, Troy. I give the samples to Dr. Camden. Now I'm gonna go have a little talk with the GRE. And what are you going to tell them? Everything. I'll meet you later, Troy. This is Crane. Do you copy? Kyle Crane. You can hear me, can you not? Rise. Where are you? Exactly where I should be, atop my own tower. Of course, mine is not quite complete, but... It still stands as a monument to chaos, to entropy, to what it means to be ruled only by oneself. I'll kill you for what you did to Jade. For everything, I'll fucking kill you! I had hoped that would be your attitude. You see, we are at war, you and I. A war of opposing philosophies. A war to see whose vision of the world proves true. Come, Crane. Come and challenge me. What is it you Americans are so fond of saying? I dare you. You know what? Forget it. There is no war. There's only your fucked up outlook. Go to hell. Oh, no, 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 no. I won't be going to hell. I will be leaving around, though, you see. I have made a deal with our GRE brothers, using your very own communicator, no less. They know I have all of Dr. Zera's research data. They call it the keys to the kingdom. Very shortly, a helicopter will come and take me away. Imagine the damage I shall be able to do outside the confines of these walls. Of course, if you think you can stop me. You crazy son of a bitch! That is what I had hoped to hear. Come and find me, Crane. Let us finish what we began.
taking you out.
What the hell? I knew you could not resist Gray. Oh, would you just shut up? You're the last thing I want to hear. What? Hear me? What a brilliant idea. <sighs> <laughs> Much better. It is fitting that an orchestra plays when kings clash.
entrance. Perhaps you are a king. A king of mud. Dear Crane, accept an offering to the king. You cannot kill me. You cannot defeat me. You cannot even reach me. What the fuck is going on? This is what we get for trying to make a living. Rice betrayed us all. Yeah, I'm on my way up there, Kareem. I'm gonna kill that motherfucker with my bare hands. Not this way. We've laid mines on the two floors above us. Go through the second block as high as you can. And you can come back. Sporting up me, taking aim at me. I liked you better when you didn't talk so damn much. But I consider it a matter of, let us call it, leveling the game. That's a term you can understand, yes?
So, face to face again. I guess that means I don't need this anymore. With or without it, Suleiman, you're dead. Come now, Crane. Do not pretend you don't care. How many lives depend on this disc? Hundreds? Thousands? Perhaps billions. <clears throat> You are right about one thing, Crane. Suleiman, he's dead. He died with his brother in this city. You don't even belong here, Crane. You don't know what suffering is. You want me to make my own rules? Rule number one, you're gonna spend the rest of your goddamn life in fucking agony. Do not leave me like this, Kren. Prove you are a man. You just take your vengeance. Will you just shut the fuck up? to tell you to go fuck yourself, but why don't we just pretend for a minute that you don't think I'm stupid? You need the cure. It's here, in the city, somewhere. And as long as it is, you won't try to pull any ministry-style bullshit. Crane, why do you even give a fuck what happens to these people? You don't belong here. This is just a job for you. No, not anymore it's not. I'll be in touch when I've decided what to do next. It's Camden. 
Yeah, Doc, I hear you. What's going on? The analysis just finished on the tissue samples. The results are... Well, I don't think the word phenomenal is too strong. Crane, if you can recover Zara's data, I'm certain a cure is within reach. All right. Hey, we'll talk about it next time I see you. This is Ayo speaking. Get to the nearest safe house and wait until dawn. Good night, and good luck. <laughs>